It's Monday the 21st of August and on today's DeFi and Pulse Chain news, powered by PowerCity.io. Is Bitcoin heading to 20k and what does this mean for the crypto space? And how is the Pulse Chain ecosystem faring in the current climate too? So with no further ado, let's go. The BTC USD chart is down 11% in the past seven days, which of course had a knock on effect with the rest of the market, with pretty much everything else sitting in the red. Many are calling for a 20K Bitcoin price if 25K doesn't hold, and another retest there would give us a clear indicator of how things may play out to the downside. Now, this has been Bitcoin's worst weekly decline since the FTX crash last November, following the crypto market mayhem seen on Thursday last week, and the hopes of many were dashed when a decision in the court battle between Grayscale and US regulators failed to materialize on Friday. Along with the SEC's delayed response on spot Bitcoin ETFs, and apparently some insiders saying the chances of approval are slim to none. Macroeconomics also played its part as the decline across the crypto market mirrored losses in the global stock market. The MSCI World Index, which includes large and mid-cap stocks from 23 developed countries, dropped sharply on August 17th, which coincided with worries about China's economy and higher interest rates. So the near future doesn't look too rosy for the crypto space as a whole, so do brace yourself for more possible turmoil before we feel any respite in the charts. Bearish Bitcoin price action, SEC FUD and silence from RH have all contributed to pullbacks in the Pulse Chain ecosystem. But on a positive note, using the chain is still cheap as chips compared to Ethereum, with swaps costing a mere penny and sending costing between 3 and 8 cents. And at the time of filming, Pulse Chain is 586 times cheaper than Ethereum and 325 times cheaper than Bitcoin. Other stats from the past week reported by the Pulse Chain News and Talk X account are 900 new validators, $155 million in TVL, total locked value, and over 300,000 daily transactions. Also, Pulse Chain has been listed by both Forbes and Yahoo, which in turn opens another avenue for many new eyes on the ecosystem and is nothing short of of bullish long term. So once we have a solid base of DeFi dApps, meme coins, NFT marketplaces and other projects that interest crypto investors, the whole ecosystem becomes a much more attractive space and it may be hard right now to see the wood through the trees but there are many things to look forward to and that are coming down the pipe. This has been your Pulse Chain and DeFi news on Monday the 21st of August 2023 and if you like this video you're also going to love this one here. Click it, watch it, let me know your thoughts and I will see you on the next one. Thank <laughs> you.